Pluto, a far-flung and enigmatic world, was once a solitary and reliable planet within our solar system. However, recent discussions among leading astrophysicists, including Neil deGrasse Tyson and Michio Kaku, have thrust Pluto back into the limelight with surprising revelations. These scientists have proposed that Pluto's orbit may eventually intersect with Neptune's, a notion that raises questions about how such a collision might occur and what the consequences could be. Could this lead to a fascinating and unusual anomaly, or is there something more to this potential planetary collision? Join us as we delve into the possible outcomes of a Pluto-Neptune impact. Pluto's Unusual Orbit Pluto, once considered a planet in its own right, is now relegated to a smaller category due to its unusual orbit and its status as a dwarf planet. Despite its demotion, Pluto remains a subject of fascination and research within the scientific community. Recent studies by leading astronomers show that Pluto's orbit is perilously close to Neptune's, raising alarms among astrophysicists like Tyson and Kaku about the possibility of a catastrophic collision between the two. But how could such a collision happen? Unlike the other planets in our solar system, Pluto follows an eccentric path around the Sun, taking an astonishing 248 years to complete one full orbit. Since its discovery in 1930, Pluto has not even finished a single orbit around the Sun. However, the intrigue surrounding Pluto does not end there. Its orbit is characterized by a highly elliptical shape, unlike the nearly circular orbits of the larger planets. What makes Pluto's orbit even more perplexing is its tilt. Pluto's orbit is tilted at an angle of 17 degrees to the plane of the solar system, which adds complexity to its orbital dynamics. This tilt, combined with its irregular shape, makes Pluto's orbit significantly more chaotic compared to the other planets. The Pluto-Neptune Interaction One of the most interesting aspects of Pluto's orbit is its interaction with Neptune's. For approximately 20 years of each orbit, Pluto actually comes closer to the Sun than Neptune, which is contrary to what one might expect based on their positions within the solar system. This raises a natural question. Why hasn't Pluto collided with Neptune? The answer lies in the gravitational influences of other planets in the solar system. When Pluto's orbit was first studied after its discovery, astronomers struggled to understand its unusual trajectory. Unlike the orbits of other planets, which lie close to the ecliptic plane, Pluto's orbit stands out due to its steep tilt and elliptical shape. The mystery surrounding Pluto's orbit only deepened when it was found that, in the grand scheme of things, Pluto's orbit does indeed cross Neptune's. This apparent paradox is resolved by the complex gravitational dynamics of the solar system, specifically through a phenomenon known as the three-body problem. The three-body problem and orbital stability. In astrophysics, the three-body problem refers to the challenge of predicting the motion of three objects, such as Pluto, Neptune, and the Sun, that influence each other through their gravitational forces. The interactions between these objects create a dynamic system that is difficult to predict, as each body affects the others in a constantly changing way. For Pluto, this three-body problem helps explain why its orbit is stable despite crossing Neptune's orbit. One key concept that keeps Pluto's orbit stable is libration. In the case of Pluto and Neptune, this term refers to the phenomenon where, whenever Pluto crosses Neptune's orbit, the two planets are always at least 90 degrees apart. This spatial separation is crucial in preventing the two bodies from colliding. Another important factor is vertical libration, which refers to the movement of a celestial body above or below the plane of its orbit. For Pluto, this means that when it comes close to Neptune, it remains situated well above or below Neptune's orbital plane, adding another layer of protection against potential collisions. A third concept that stabilizes Pluto's orbit is VZK wobbling, named after the three scientists, V, Z, and K, who studied how celestial bodies move in space. This phenomenon refers to the way Pluto, Neptune, and the Sun influence each other through gravity, causing slight shifts in their positions over time. In Pluto's case, VZK wobbling helps explain why its orbit, despite seeming erratic, remains stable. These forces contribute to maintaining Pluto's orbit for incredibly long periods, possibly even billions of years. Although Pluto's orbit is chaotic in nature, gravitational influences from other planets help keep its trajectory stable. The Importance of Orbital Mechanics In the broader context of the solar system, these forces play a vital role in preventing planets and other celestial bodies from crashing into one another. Without these stabilizing factors, the solar system would be a much more tumultuous place, with planets and dwarf planets potentially colliding or being ejected from their orbits. 
Understanding Pluto's orbit gives us insight into the dynamic nature of the solar system. It serves as a reminder that even the most seemingly unstable orbits can achieve a state of equilibrium through the intricate dance of gravitational forces. The study of Pluto's orbit also highlights the need for continual research and observation to better understand the forces that shape our solar system. Tyson, Kaku, and the future of Pluto's orbit. The question remains, why are prominent astrophysicists like Neil deGrasse Tyson raising concerns about a potential impact between Pluto and Neptune, despite all the complex forces working to prevent such a scenario? Tyson, a renowned astrophysicist who played a significant role in Pluto's reclassification from planet to dwarf planet, offers an insightful perspective on the evolving nature of celestial mechanics. He argues that while Pluto's orbit is stable for now, it may undergo significant changes in the future. This possibility highlights how much more we still have to discover about the forces that govern our solar system. Tyson acknowledges the complexities of Pluto's orbit and its interactions with Neptune while recognizing the inherent unpredictability of space. He suggests that while Pluto's orbit is stable at the moment, it could undergo significant changes in the future, serving as a reminder of the dynamic and ever-evolving nature of our understanding of the cosmos. Similarly, Michio Kaku, another renowned astrophysicist, emphasizes the importance of considering the broader context of the solar system's formation. He points out that the solar system is not a static, unchanging entity but rather a dynamic and evolving system. Just as gravitational forces between planets shape their orbits today, they will continue to do so in the future, possibly in unexpected ways. Both Tyson and Kaku recognize the role of advanced computational simulations in modeling and predicting the behavior of celestial bodies like Pluto. However, they also acknowledge that these models, while valuable, are not infallible. The inherent complexity of the three-body problem and the sensitivity of orbital dynamics to initial conditions mean that predictions about the future behavior of planets are always subject to uncertainty. Conclusion a universe of constant discovery. As we continue to study Pluto and other distant objects in the solar system, we are constantly reminded of the ever-changing and dynamic nature of space. While the scientific community has made great strides in understanding planetary motion, there is still much to explore. The study of Pluto's orbit and its interactions with Neptune provides valuable insights into the broader mechanics of the solar system. The complexity of these systems, while challenging, also opens up exciting possibilities for future exploration and discovery. Whether or not Pluto and Neptune will ever collide remains an open question. But the very notion of such an event serves as a powerful reminder of the unpredictable and ever-changing nature of the universe. Each new discovery brings us one step closer to understanding the forces that shape the stars, planets, and ultimately, our place in the cosmos. The Future of Pluto Exploration while theoretical models and astrophysical simulations have helped scientists understand Pluto's orbit and its relationship with Neptune, direct observation remains crucial for refining our understanding. The New Horizons spacecraft, which flew past Pluto in 2015, provided humanity with its first detailed images of the dwarf planet. This mission revealed Pluto as a surprisingly complex world, with towering ice mountains, flowing glaciers, and a possible subsurface ocean. However, there is still much to learn. Future space missions could provide even more detailed insights into Pluto's composition, atmosphere, and long-term orbital dynamics. Some proposed missions include a Pluto orbiter and lander. Unlike New Horizons, which only conducted a brief flyby, an orbiter would allow scientists to study Pluto over an extended period, tracking changes in its surface and atmosphere. A lander could provide critical data about its geological activity and internal structure. Kuiper Belt Exploration since Pluto is part of the Kuiper Belt, a region filled with icy bodies beyond Neptune, future missions could explore how Pluto interacts with other objects in this distant part of the solar system. Gravitational Studies More precise measurements of Pluto's interactions with Neptune, Uranus, and even Jupiter could refine our understanding of its long-term orbital stability. These missions would not only provide deeper insight into Pluto's place in the solar system, but also help scientists understand the formation and evolution of planetary systems beyond our own. The role of the Kuiper Belt in Pluto's orbit One of the key factors influencing Pluto's movement is its position within the Kuiper Belt. This vast, icy region contains thousands of small celestial bodies, many of which share characteristics with Pluto. Some astronomers believe that Pluto's eccentric orbit may have been influenced by past gravitational interactions with other Kuiper Belt objects, 
or even an unknown ninth planet lurking at the edge of the solar system. Recent simulations suggest that over millions of years, gravitational perturbations from Neptune and other massive planets could alter the orbits of Kuiper Belt objects, potentially shifting Pluto's trajectory in ways we cannot yet predict. If such changes occur, they could eventually affect Pluto's relationship with Neptune, leading to new orbital patterns, or, in extreme cases, an eventual ejection from the solar system. This raises an intriguing question. Could Pluto one day become a rogue planet? Could Pluto be ejected from the solar system? Rogue planets are celestial bodies that have been flung out of their home star systems, wandering alone through interstellar space. While Pluto is currently stable within the Sun's gravitational influence, its long-term fate remains uncertain. Several factors could influence Pluto's future. 1. Encounters with other Kuiper Belt objects A close encounter with another large Kuiper Belt object could disturb Pluto's orbit, pushing it into a new, unpredictable trajectory. 2. Neptune's gravitational influence If Neptune's orbit changes significantly due to interactions with other planets or external forces, it could disrupt the resonance that currently keeps Pluto stable. 3. The hypothetical ninth planet. Some astronomers theorize that a massive, undiscovered planet exists beyond Pluto. If such a planet were to influence Pluto's orbit, it could lead to unpredictable consequences. While an ejection from the solar system is unlikely, Pluto's long-term stability remains an open question. Over billions of years, even small perturbations can lead to dramatic shifts in planetary orbits, meaning that Pluto's position in the distant future is far from guaranteed. The Broader Implications for Planetary Science The study of Pluto's orbit is about more than just one dwarf planet. It provides a window into the fundamental forces that shape our entire solar system. Understanding how planetary orbits evolve over time helps scientists make predictions about the future of the solar system and even about planetary systems beyond our own. Exoplanet Research Many exoplanets, planets outside our solar system, follow highly elliptical orbits similar to Pluto's. Studying Pluto helps scientists develop models that can be applied to distant solar systems. Solar System Evolution The chaotic nature of Pluto's orbit highlights the ever-changing dynamics of our solar system. These insights can help astronomers understand how planetary systems form and evolve over time. Astrobiology Pluto's potential subsurface ocean raises questions about the conditions necessary for life. Studying Pluto could provide clues about habitability on other icy worlds, such as Europa and Enceladus. Conclusion Pluto's Everlasting Mystery Despite being reclassified as a dwarf planet, Pluto remains one of the most fascinating celestial bodies in the solar system. Its chaotic orbit, complex interactions with Neptune, and position within the Kuiper Belt make it a crucial subject of study for astronomers and planetary scientists. While a collision between Pluto and Neptune remains highly improbable, the very possibility forces us to reconsider our understanding of planetary motion and gravitational interactions. Pluto serves as a reminder that our solar system is not static. It is a constantly evolving dance of celestial bodies, shaped by unseen forces over immense timescales. As new discoveries continue to emerge, Pluto's story is far from over. Whether through future space missions, advanced computer simulations, or groundbreaking theoretical models, humanity's quest to understand this icy world is just beginning. Pluto's